So this new app is about quality sensing. It is called Mobile Observatory. And from its name, you can guess that it allows users to observe places for environmental parameters. Like, for example, you can watch out what are the temperature, humidity, but also air quality uh, values. Like, for example, ozone level or also uh, particulate matter or CO level. This application and this project is based on the OpenSense project, which is a collaboration project between EPFL and ETH. Uh, in the framework of this project, we developed uh, sens sensor boxes, which are boxes that contain sensors for uh, humidity, temperature, ozone, particulate matter, and also CO2. And these boxes are put on the roof of buses in Lausanne and trams in Zurich. Then the data is aggregated on servers, and from these servers we uh, take everything in Lausanne so that we can process the information and generate indices. These indices are then pushed to the application uh, on the mobile phones according to the, to the selection of the users to the places that they want to monitor. I have selected uh, several locations that I either live or study or work so I can check um, how the air quality in those places are. And um, it's nice to observe, for example, that where I live, the air quality is better than in the center of Zurich. The main advantage of this application is that we are dealing with real-time values. It is a more dynamic application, it allows users to correlate what they see on the screen and what is happening around. For example, they can notice that places are more polluted than others uh, regarding on what is the traffic around and also defining what is the best route for jogging or other uh, kind of activity outdoor. But also this has um, kind of educational uh, goal by uh, having people learn to recognize or to see or to sense things that human actually cannot really sense like air quality or this kind of uh, ozone level or this kind of other values.